Hello again, let's continue our Voron journey and let's start assembling uh, the gantry starting from the front idlers. First of all, take these two parts which are uh, called tensioners. Yes, these are front idler tensioners and install two uh, threaded inserts into them. So, how do idlers actually work and how the tensioners actually work? You have this small tension which is uh, which look like a clip and you have this idler body and uh, the belt goes here through these two holes and uh, over the bearing stack which you will later install here. The bearing stack consists of uh, two uh, 695 bearings which are pressed together like this, so the form like a very small pulley, which is also another genius idea from Warrantine. You clip your tensioner, uh, here you will have a screw, holding the bearing stack and when you are moving your tensioner, your bearing stack moves along it and you will have one screw which regulates how far or close the tensioner should be. So let's assemble. So first of all you clip the tensioner over, over the idler body. Then you will have to do a very peculiar installation part, which is uh, threading an M5 40mm screw from the top of the idler, so the, uh, from the top of the tensioner to the, to the idler body. And then you will have to install the sandwich. The sandwich starts with uh, this little spacer which you use throughout the Warren installation then you install one bearing then you install the second bearing and you really have to try hard to catch it in the correct position and then you install one more Spacer and then just put your M5 screw all the way down. If it turns correctly, this should look like this. So there is uh, two bearings which rotate freely and form a pulley, and two spacers here. If you turn this correctly, you can take an M5 nut, nut, please nut, yes, and put it in your tensioner and then tighten it all up. To regulate the tension you need to take an M3 40mm screw, this one and a washer. Not the spacer which is used but M3 washer. And put it here. So now I can just turn this M3 screw and align your uh, tensioner those tensioning the belts like this. And of course repeat the same procedure for the other uh, idler body and tensioner.